What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Now today, I am so excited to finally reveal my Jeffree Star Cosmetics Holiday Collection. Now, I've been doing a few little sneak peeks here and there on Instagram and Snapchat. The other day, I posted the unit cartons and I revealed the color of my packaging this year is hot cherry glossy red. Um, now, if you've been a fan of my brand for a while, you know that last year, we did all white and gold packaging and listen, I learned quickly how insane the holidays are and how amazing and unreal and devoted that my customers are because last year I introduced my shade Androgyny and I'm like, okay, I'm gonna order enough for probably like a month. The first three hours last year, gone. And I was like, oh, you guys made a bitch shock. Now I definitely planned ahead way better than last year and hopefully things will not sell out in an hour this time. Um, definitely produced a lot of units and I'm really excited that, you know, 2016 was a year where I got to expand my business. Now my website is fully, almost finally all back in stock. It's like crazy playing catch up and I think a lot of people forget, you know, I am an indie brand. I'm not in any malls, I'm not in any stores, which is a choice and I wanted to stay e-commerce and I wanted to have my business only online. I definitely like to have full control and I don't want any corporations fucking with my vision. It's been a learning experience just growing quickly and just, it's been, I don't know, I'm like speechless because it's been such a crazy, blessed, amazing year. So I wanted to end it with a bang. And in today's video, I'm gonna be swatching all seven, actually there's eight, and I'm sure a lot of you were like, oh, oh, oh. There is seven holiday liquid lips, and I also have my first ever metallic shade, which I debuted in my tattoo diaries a few weeks ago. It is a crazy Barbie pink, which you'll see later on, and that will be launching on Cyber Monday. So unlike my holiday collection, the pink metallic shade will come in my standard pink Barbie unit carton, and BAM! This is it. This shade is called Dream House, and I wore this in a few videos, and so many people were like, oh my god, when is that coming out? And I wasn't really loving my metallic formula, so I'm sure if you guys know, way earlier on in the year, I gave a few sneak peeks of other shades. Now, I didn't love the formula, and I can never put out anything that is half-ass or that isn't perfect from my standards. So the peachy gold metallic one that everyone saw floating all over the internet will definitely be coming out early next year. I'm sure you're all like <laughs> But um, this one, I finally perfected the formula. It is unreal, stunning, blinding, and metallic as fuck. So this will be coming out exclusively on my website for Cyber Monday, which I'm really excited for. Back to the holiday collection. I am about to swatch all seven of these, but I want to kind of break it down for you guys. I know that there are a lot of new subscribers and a lot of new customers this year. So, first of all, there are seven. Now, last year I did five, but this year, you know what? I'm like, you know, I need to put out a few more. There will be seven limited edition liquid lips and they all come in this beautiful cherry red packaging and the caps are BAM! Red. A few quick things that I want everyone to know about these is that they will obviously be sold individually for $18, just like the regular ones, but there will be a special bundle with all seven shades that will be $99.99. So you definitely get a really good deal. So if you want to snag all seven, you will definitely be able to do that and this entire collection, minus the Cyber Monday pink lip, will be launching on Black Friday, which is November 25th, and it's not just any old day, it is my brand's two year anniversary. I just can't believe it. I'm like, <gasps> like the time has gone by so fast and we're gonna be celebrating our two year anniversary or birthday type of thing. <laughs> so all the liquid lips and the bundle will be coming out on Black Friday, November 25th, as well as two <laughs> as well as two limited edition skin frost highlighting powders, which we are going to show you and swatch in this video. Oh my god, girl, when I show you these highlighters, y'all are going to be shook to the core. Now, just to refresh your memory, my entire brand is vegan, it is cruelty free, and I only use top of the line ingredients. So besides that, I think it's time to uh, get my sister over here, my pink sister-in-law. <laughs> And um, we're about to swatch everything for you, so um, y'all ready? Oh, hi, baby. 
Hi everyone. I'm so excited. Hi guys. So this is one of my really good friends, Nikita Dragon. Hi everyone. Yes. <laughs> my pink sister. sister. Uh, she's actually my daughter. Um, I've never told you guys about her before. Mm -hmm. but, from um, your last egg. Yeah. <laughs> yes. From the one egg that came yeah. down from your ovaries. <laughs> when, listen, I was 16 a long time ago. <laughs> So I brought Nikita here, not only because we are about to swatch eight liquid lips, but you guys, Nikita is basically like a brand ambassador for Jeffree Star Cosmetics, and this holiday season, she is one of the faces of the campaign! Ah! I'm actually gonna show them a few pictures right now. Nikita just saw them for the first time uh, like a few hours ago. I'm and wreck. Yes, she, she started her period on the spot, bitch. But um, here is a few images of the campaign. Oh, look at that hair. Look at that makeup, girl. Yes, we're serving like, I don't know, what are we serving? Goddess. And then here is a picture of me solo. Uh, bam, come on. With that gold cap. I can't breathe. Um, shout out to my makeup artist lipstick Nick you fucking killed it for the holiday shoot and I just I I can't even so basically everyone is uh, waiting for us to shut our mouths and get to revealing these colors ah, I'm so excited <laughs> all right so when you look at all these shades what do you gravitate to first like I want to swatch one that your eyes want first Wait, I think just one kind of, huh just one you actually just <laughs> one right now like if these were on the table and they were like all right bitch thank you I have to go with this one. Oh. Crocodile tears? Yes! Okay, you guys, this is a dark, ivy, sexy green, oh, and her name is Crocodile Tears. I love that you went for this first. Wait, bitch. I was like, can I just, I was, I'm trying to listen to you talk right now, <laughs> but I'm over here like. Yes, so at the shoot that we did, um, Nikita only wore two colors. I had a bunch of models and myself, so we all um, wore different ones. So you haven't even worn most of these. Mm -mm. Oh, 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 what is in this? Is this your okay. baby juice in this baby? <laughs> Okay, Sister, so people I'm always want to know about smells because a lot of my nudes smell like root beer. So this holiday season, there is some that actually have shimmer and glitter in them, which we're about to dive into. Mm -hmm. But the ones that do not have a faint cotton candy smell. I die. Which is really cute, right? So it's not overpowering. So a lot of them are mild cotton candy. Oh, wait, before we even swatch this, I do want to say one thing that I actually improved my packaging. And what I mean by that is that it's more airtight and it's more sturdy. So do you feel how it's a little like click it? Who knew you could get any tighter, uh. baby? <laughs> it's a little more. She's like, on it. She's like, on it. Yeah. Um, and it's just a little more anywhere. airtight. So come TSA's on, TSA's not playing me this time. No. Bitch. <laughs> All right, let's put her on. All right, here is Crocodile Tears Dried. How are you feeling about it, honey? Um, I'm actually feeling like I need to go rob a bank. <laughs> this very moment. Isn't it sick? Oh. So last year, I put out a green shade called Mistletoe, and it's been a year now since that came out, so everyone's like, are you gonna bring it back this are you year? Back? So I switched it up, did a darker, some more seductive, um, you know, version of that one, and here's what happened. So I'm like feeling it. I'm like feeling myself. Yeah, I'm, like, I don't, I'm, I'm, I'm over here having my own music video, real quick. Mm -hmm. Pause. Hi, <laughs> sister. Yes. You really killed it with this. Now, one. if they're afraid of dark lips, what should they do? Shut the bug up and dry it on anyway. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so the next shade that we're about to debut is one called Deceased. Hi. Hashtag Deceased, <laughs> hashtag Cremated, hashtag Hi. It's so weird. I never heard of this word until you started using it. Hi. <laughs> Um, now, this is a really pretty mauve nude. It is gorgeous. Mm. It's like it's like if Scorpio mm. had a little sister, this would be her. You ready to swatch her? Uh, I'm like already diving in. Yeah. <laughs> <I was> like... <laughs> Here is deceased dry. I'm looking in the monitor like, oh. Ooh. It's, I don't, know, I don't know, like, I just needed this in my collection. I feel like mm. it was missing, and I feel like any skin tone can wear this. I mean, this is like an everyday lip for me. Yeah, it's very, I, feel, I feel like it's very universal. This is one of my favorites, I think, from the collection. Since we are in the holiday season, I had to name this next liquid lip after one of my favorite desserts. So this shade is called... Pumpkin pie, bam! Now, if you uh, can see on the zoom in, this has little fine micas of glitter inside of it. So this was inspired by my favorite dessert. I love the holiday season and I'm a pumpkin pie whore. So this just uh, represents my love for that.
This is pumpkin pie dry. Oh, mm. I love it with my eye look. I'm like, mm. yeah, it looks really sickening. This is definitely more on the safer side, even though it's a little different and unique shade. I think everyone should be able to pull this off and embrace it. When you rub it, it kind of activates the glitter more. See that? Are you living? Is this magic? So you just take your finger, preferably the middle one. Okay. And just kind of rub gently. Like don't rub like you're trying to take it off, but. <gasps> Are you living? It's cool, right? So it's like when you're like kissing someone, it's just like. It act, yes. Hi. It's like, Hi, unicorn. <laughs> <laughs> yes. All right, let's get to the next one. <laughs> the next shade is one of my favorites. I think it is the <sighs> darkest in the collection. Mm. Bam. This one is called Designer Blood. Ooh. Um, now listen, you've worn Unicorn Blood a lot. I was just about to ask, what is the difference? Unicorn Blood is one of your go-tos, right? It's my first sure go-to. It looks a little similar in the bottle, but let me tell you, when this is swatched and on your mouth, definitely different, and we're about to insert a little swatch comparison. Mm -hmm. Now, Unicorn Blood is literally, I think, in my top three best sellers of all time, oh, and... Sister, I live for <sighs> I live yes. for a good Unicorn Blood. So, this was inspired by that, and I wanted to give it a little mm -hmm. slight twist, because we all know I'm a designer whore. And is it's this just what your blood looks like. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> so, you know, a little play on words mm -hmm. to have fun. But, um, so when this dries down mm -hmm. and it's completely dry and matte, it has this weird shift of like a gold tone. Stop it. It's hard to like explain until you're about to watch and see it, but it's like Unicorn Blood when it's dry is like rusty, dark, dark red. This one just has a little bit of a little uh to it. And it's slightly uh. darker, so. So when you're in your lab, you want, you're like, I want a little uh in, the, For, in yes. the shade. I told the chemist, I want a little uh. <laughs> All right, let's swatch this bad boy. If you guys don't get any presents for whatever holiday you celebrate, and you're wondering where all the little magical elves are, uh -huh. they're at this bitch's factory. <laughs> <laughs> Working so hard. Oh, this color on you, I'm looking in the monitor like, fuck! Oh. So once it dries, it gets that like no, kind of sheen, it. and hopefully you guys can tell on camera. All right, let's swatch the next one. The next shade is, I think, the lightest of the collection. Mm -hmm. It is a soft, pale, pinkish, kind of warm toned nude and it has fine micas of glitter in it as well. Mica, whoa, Yes, baby. baby. Yes. <laughs> and she looks a little something like this. Beep. Boom. So this shade is called Chrysanthemum. When I was younger, my grandma, rest in peace, right here on my neck, she would cover the entire house with chrysanthemums when it was the holiday time. So it definitely reminded me of her and she loved wearing really soft nude colors. So That's so pretty. Yes. So, let's, so let's give her a little whirl. This is chrysanthemum dried. I actually love it on you more than me. Not gonna mm. lie. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, for real. I'm like, yeah, it looks so good. I mean, you're so golden and bronzed, and Thank like, you, oh, your skin tone is so beautiful. And I'm just like, but on you, it's like a like a, such a soft whisper. It's really soft. Like if mm -hmm. you're just ready to go on the beach for a soft picnic and maybe a gaping, this could be. Really <laughs> yeah. This could be really, or this is a really good like going to church and celebrating life and love mm. and you know being on your knees. God, you did it. Yeah, thank you, baby. You did it for her, baby. Yes, thank. Come on, <laughs> my jacket's like come give on, me your man. life. So in between takes, we've been diving into the Jeffree oh, Star Cosmetics. I ate so much lip scrub. I think I'm in a sugar high. I'm like, <laughs> yes. If you guys have never checked these out, um, shameless plug. They exfoliate. They have vitamin E. They're edible. They're vegan, and mm -hmm. there's aloe vera in them. And oh, my lips feel amazing now. So next shade is I'm sure everyone is like it's Christmas where is like the red type of vibe mm -hmm. besides designer blood which is very dark red I had to create something that was a little loud a little obnoxious and a little a uh, little bright BAM Ooh. this shade is called checkmate guess who named this who Nathan you're lying no 
Like when I was trying it on, I was like, what do you think a cool name would be? Help me name it. And he came up with Checkmate. And I was like, that's kind of okay. sick. Okay. I'm like, oh, okay. Okay, now you have to name all the other ones. Right? I'm like, do you want your own brand? Just kidding. <laughs> so this is kind of similar to one of my shades called Anna Nicole. I'm sure you guys are looking at it like, looks a little Anna Nicole-y. Um, it is darker, way darker. And you'll see in a second. I've it's a lot more vibrant and has like a darker tone though. Like dark, but bright at the same time. Mm -hmm. Here is Checkmate Bam Dried. Checkmate, baby. Now, tell me what you were saying a second ago. Okay, like, just looking at this, I wouldn't be like, okay, have her grab it. I'd just be like, oh, whatever, like, that's not for me. Like, right. I could never pull that off. I literally just put it on right now, and I'm just like, hi. <laughs> <laughs> it's cool, huh? Checkmate. I think we all kind of get stuck in our own, like, rut of always wearing kind of the same similar mm -hmm. shades. I mean, obviously, we love what we love. But I think we should try stepping outside the outside of the box a little more sometimes and just giving it a whirl, okay? All right, so we have one more holiday shade to swatch for you guys, and then we're gonna swatch the Dreamhouse Pink Metallic um, that's coming out on Cyber Monday. Mm. Come on, Cyber. Picture if Scorpio and Androgyny just had a baby. Came together. And you are going to get a really gorgeous shade, and she Gosh. is called Sagittarius. Bam! Hi. Are you living? I'm living. <laughs> Reminds me of my Tinder date the other day. Oh, I'm gonna slap you. <laughs> I feel like this is gonna be one of your favorites. Yeah. You love these tones. I, these are my favorite like, tones ever. Yes. Androgyny. She bathes and lives mm. in androgyny. Oh All right, God. let's watch this bad boy. All right, here is Sagittarius Dry. I'm living. Oh. This is gonna be one of those shades that people are like, oh, maybe, and then once they wear it, they're oh, gonna be like, everything. Oh, or maybe you're, they're all watching at home like, bitch, we love it, shut your mouth. Shut your mouth. Um, Put it on the site, reloading. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> now, I do wanna say one thing. When you put Deceased and Sagittarius next to each other, um, in the bottle, they do kind of look similar. But as you can see, Deceased is way more nude, and this one is way more like mauve purple. Um, and also, just because I know you're all gonna ask, I'm gonna insert a swatch comparison. Right now, here they are of me putting them side by side. So you can definitely tell there's a difference. All right, guys, so that was all seven of the holiday limited edition Velour Liquid Lipsticks. Now we have one more liquid lip to swatch. This is, Woo! This is the color of my soul, I think. Oh! And I also made a matching mm. highlighter with it, which we'll talk about in a second, but this one is called Dreamhouse. It is my first ever metallic liquid lip from my brand. Many more to come, by the way. So let's take this off and put this bitch on. Oh, I'm so ready. <laughs> All right, here is Dreamhouse. Oh. The way that it like reflects off of light in the sun, and it's so shimmery and so like, mm. All right guys, so this shade will be coming out separately. It is a limited edition item that will be available only on uh, Cyber Monday, which will be cool on my website. And on Cyber Monday, there is free shipping. Oh. Hi. And also free shipping on Black Friday. Hi, uh -huh. I'm, I'm gonna go wait and queue Sorry, right so actually all <laughs> seven shades and uh, no shipping. Besides that, there is two skin frosts that are coming out on Black Friday as well. It's a Black Friday slow fucking like it slow down. It down. A few weeks ago, I gave a sneak peek of my highlighter, which is called Regina George. Hi. And it looks something like this. It is literally hot pink. Oh, these kind of go together, yeah? Oh yeah, literally they're like the perfect match together. So this is coming out and then we all, will you please hold oh, it? I have another shade coming out. It is a it. icy baby pink shade and she is called Princess Cut. Woo! When you swatch this, you're gonna gag. It is so pretty. Oh! It's basically if ice cold um, went pink for the holidays. You sneezed on it. Yes. Basically. <laughs> basically. Now, yeah. this looks flawless over blush. It does have some pigment to it, of course. So you can wear it by itself. You can put it over like as a blush topper. Mm -hmm. You can actually, if you had like a regular lip, you can take some and put it on the top of the lip. Um, only thing about this guy is because my brand is vegan, now you have to use special um, like red dyes and pigments. Yeah. So Regina George is the only skin frost that is not eye safe. 
So, I see. Yes. Okay. So what that means Let is, us know. Um, I still put it on my eyes. So mm -hmm. if you put it on your eyes or your, or your lids, it's not like it's gonna burn or um, do anything crazy. It just stains your skin. Yes, and that, that's pretty much everything. Let, that's a but, lot. The, but legally, you have to put out that warning, and I would never want people to, to like, yeah. um, have a stained lid and be like, "What the fuck?" So a lot of the mm -hmm. times, you know, we've used other brands that their lipsticks wipe it off, and you're li and you're stained. Yes. I'm stained for a while. Yeah, exactly, which is normal, but some people don't want their eyelid stained, which I totally get. So I think we should do a few finger swatches. And if you don't mind, I'm gonna put a little princess cut on your uh, cheeks. Maybe I'd be little... honored. Yes, okay, cool. All right, so here is Regina George. Bam, oh, it looks so pretty. Oh. Are you living? Here it is on me. I am really pale, so this is gonna look really fun. Isn't that cool? This is beautiful. I thought it would be like more of like crazy, like just in your face. It's not. It's, but it's subtle like, and it's really like pretty, really and it has pretty a real, yeah. So it's like literally like a highlight and almost like a blush in one, if you want it to yeah. be that way. But um, yeah, it's not as intense as people um, I think we're first thinking. All right, now this is Princess Cut, girl. <laughs> Bam! Oh, oh my god! It is really blinding, and it's like a wow! I mean, it, it's like really like it's like that really baby pink. Yes, it's so she subtle. She is baby pink. I'm over here like breaking my arm and like it's so pretty. Yeah. Okay, we'll put it on me. There we go. It is. Excuse me, I had lip swatches all over my hands earlier, but there is um. <laughs> Princess Kai. Oh, it's the blinding. Poor the poor camera. The poor, I need a new lens. So I'm gonna be applying the highlighter with my favorite Morphe 510 brush. Use code Dragon with a U. <laughs> <laughs> um, <Thank you. laughs> it actually works in store and online. Yes. <laughs> I don't personally have a Morphe code or any code at all, so I always encourage you guys to use my friends. I'm gonna put Princess Cut on your cheeks and then a little Regina because why not? Ooh. Oh, oh, oh. That's blinding. <laughs> How? That is, I know, it's a little extreme. No, I live. Oh, I live. I thought this was like a subtle do, like I just walked out of the Oh, house. hell no. So I'm wearing a mixture of Peach Goddess and Ice Cold, but I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna put a little princess cut on this bitch. Hi. Ooh, it's like glass on my cheeks, baby. Now I'm gonna take a fan brush from Morphe. This is the 310. The other one was the 510. Maybe I said it wrong, fuck it, okay. Now this one, you can be really subtle with the fan brush. Of course, this is more for really highlighting. This one is more for like a little, a little, a little soft dusting, if mm -hmm. you will. So I'm gonna put this in the high planes of her cheekbones and not all the way at the um, the base is what we like to call it. Stop trying to make fetch happen, baby. So fetch. You go, Glen Coco. You fun. <laughs> oh, that looks really pretty. Yes. Like it's not too crazy. It's just no, a little. No, it's not. Like, it's uh, really like not like. It's all about how heavy-handed people are. I think Regina George could look amazing on anyone. Mm -hmm. It is so versatile and fun. So I think if you're down to take a little risk, this one's gonna be perfect for you. All right. Um. Ew. You're like really pretty. <laughs> So I think she does car commercials in Japan. Ah! <laughs> All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching this. In the comments down below, we want to know what your favorite shades were and what you are most excited for. So mark the calendars, Black Friday and Cyber Monday. Saddle up, it is gonna Ooh. be so fun. If you're not already, subscribe to Nikita Dragon's channel. Oh. Everything will be linked down below. Listen, if you... If, the makeup tutorials though, is it's kind of slaying on another level. So if you haven't checked out Nikita, <laughs> what the fuck are you waiting for? <laughs> but um, thank you guys so much for watching this and thank you for joining me. Are you kidding? Thank you for having yes, me. Baby. I love Mwah. Thank you for sharing this and this is such a full circle and congratulations yes. on yet another successful collection. Yay, thank you so much. <laughs> and um, I'm just honored that you are a part of it and everyone that orders from my website will be getting um, some postcards with us on it. A little collectible, They're not if you ready. will. They're not, not ready. ready. And also, I wanted to quickly say that my brand for all my UK and European fans and customers, you can now shop on beautybay.com and they will have this full holiday collection. Come on, EU. Come on, EU. Come on, International. Yes. Come on, International. And also, um, I know that there's a lot of crazy counterfeit and fake Jeffrey mm -hmm. products going around, which is mm -hmm. insane and really sad, but. If you want to know where you can buy my products and from all my official retailers, head on over to jeffreystarcosmetics.com and uh, click that FAQ, bitch. Hi. But um, all right, thank you guys so much, and uh, we'll see you on the next one. Mwah.